Look how Michaela's holding both of Jenny's lapels. She's controlling her shoulders, and even better, she's controlling her neck and head. So when she snaps her, her whole body will come, and she will throw her. Okay, let's take a look at kind of a, a pop pop or snap snap action. What Michaela's going to do here, she's got a double lapel grip, and we're going to do an Ipon Nagi, and she's going to do, as she moves backwards, she's going to do step step or snap snap and hit her knee, knee drop Sunny Nagi. So just go ahead and, and do it, Michaela. There you go. So you can see, come on back the other way, stay there and come on back the other way. You can see how she's on the lapels, and this really works well, the snap snap action, or this pop pop action, works well because look how Michaela's holding both of Jenny's lapels. She's controlling her shoulders, and even better, she's controlling her neck and head. So when she snaps her, her whole body will come, and she will throw her. So this is a really strong method of getting reaction. And when you snap on somebody, they, they naturally want to react. You know, they, they want to re resist. And this works on a, 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 a principle of judo called hando no kazushi, or breaking their balance by making them react. It's a reaction type thing. So let's look at it one more time, back and forth, stamp, stamp, and throw. And you can see how she do that. But again, you can see how she controls that shoulder, controls the head, and it really just gives more velocity to the throw, more, more, more force. So go ahead. And there you go. So it's a pop, pop, or snap, snap, knee drop, say, knocking.